Common Samsung Galaxy A34 problems and how to fix them. How to fix Samsung Galaxy A34 heating issue. After the phone is fully charged, unplug the phone. It often causes overheating problems. Make sure to use a thin back cover. Using a thick back cover may result in improper ventilation of your phone and cause heating problems. Don't play games while your phone is charging. And don't use your phone too much while it's charging. Always use the original charger when charging the Samsung Galaxy A34 smartphone. The biggest cause of phone overheating is playing for long hours. It is a common problem in almost every smartphone. Do not install unsupported apps and games on your phone. It often causes overheating problems. Always keep your phone up to date and update all your apps regularly. Don't let your phone storage full. Because of this, your phone may become slow and cause heating issues. Sometimes due to the high temperature of your home environment, even heating problems can occur. Always download your app from the Google Play Store. Sometimes apps downloaded from the internet can cause heating issues. If your battery is too old and not in a healthy condition, then this is also the main reason why your Samsung Galaxy A34 smartphone is overheating. Also, unlock bootloader on Samsung Galaxy A34. Poor battery life on the Samsung Galaxy A34. If your Samsung Galaxy A34 battery is draining quickly, you can follow the steps below. By following the steps below, you can confirm the cause of the problem on your smartphone. Bad battery life. How to fix poor battery life on your Samsung Galaxy A34. Always turn GPS off when GPS is not needed. If you have installed apps like Phone Cleaner, uninstall them. These apps run in the background and consume your phone's battery. Never download apps other than Play Store. These apps may contain malware that runs in the background of your phone and leads to battery draining issues. Always try to use your phone in the general settings. Do not use your Samsung Galaxy A34 in custom settings and this may be the reason for the poor battery life. If you experience a significant decrease in the battery percentage of your phone, try to replace the battery. Using the Samsung Galaxy A34 in high screen brightness settings may quickly drain your battery. If you are playing more games then this must also be the reason why your battery is draining fast. Check if you are facing battery issues after installing any apps on your phone. If you install an app that claims it will boost your phone's battery backup, uninstall it. Keeping your phone in power saving mode for long hours also causes the battery to drain quickly. If the battery issue persists after following the steps above, try to factory reset your Samsung Galaxy A34. After following the above steps, I am sure you will never face it again. If you still have any problems, contact your smartphone customer support and follow the instructions. Sluggish or sluggish user interface on Samsung Galaxy A34. Do you feel sluggish and sluggish user interface while using your phone? If yes, here is the complete solution for your device. Please read all steps carefully before applying them to your phone. How to fix Samsung Galaxy A34 Android device lag issue. If you are using any antivirus app on your phone or any junk cleaner app then uninstall it. Make sure that there is enough space on your phone's internal storage. If your phone is running out of space, free up some space. And your Samsung Galaxy A34 will be back to normal. Connect your phone to a computer, laptop and scan with Quick Heal or any other trusted antivirus software. It will remove the virus from your phone. 
Sometimes, you may experience sluggish and sluggish experience due to slow internet. Go to settings greater than system. Reset options greater than select. Erase all data. Factory reset. There is a high chance that your phone will run faster after a factory reset than before. Useless apps. Uninstall them. Sometimes, using a custom theme on your phone can slow down your phone's performance. If you recently installed a third-party launcher on your Samsung Galaxy A34, it might be causing this problem. You can uninstall it and go back to the default theme. Try to perform a basic restart of your device and check if the problem is fixed. Check if your phone is running the latest Android version. If not, update your phone to the latest operating system available. Update all your apps as soon as updates become available. I have discussed all possible solutions to fix Samsung Galaxy A34 lag issues. Camera problems in Samsung Galaxy A34. Samsung has had camera issues with its new Samsung Galaxy A34 phone. The phone camera randomly shuts down, and it is not clear why. You can follow the steps below to fix it. Camera problems. How to fix camera issues on your Samsung Galaxy A34. There is a bug in the Android operating system that causes this problem. You have to wait for an official update from Samsung before you can fix it. If you are having trouble with the camera settings, go back to the default settings. To get the most out of your camera, turn on image stabilization. Clear the camera app's cache and try to open it again if you're still having trouble. You can enable the HD option within the camera app for better image quality. If you made any changes to the camera settings, go back to the default mode and check if the problem is fixed. Remove the screen protector from your phone and check if this fixes the problem. Moreover, clean Samsung Galaxy A34 camera lens to fix blurry photo issues. Your Samsung Galaxy A34 shuts down unexpectedly. This problem is very common among Android smartphones. In this problem, your phone suddenly turns off. If you encounter the same problem with your Samsung Galaxy A34 smartphone, consider the following steps. The phone is turned off unexpectedly. How to fix sudden shutdown in Samsung Galaxy A34. First, check if your Samsung Galaxy A34 battery is working fine or not. To do this, Go to the phone dialer and type asterisk hash asterisk hash 4636 hash asterisk hash asterisk and dial. Now you can see battery information. If your phone gets too hot, then this may also be the reason for your phone suddenly shutting down. Don't use bulky back covers. This may cause heating problems due to improper ventilation. Check if your phone's internal storage has some space left. If not, then this might be the reason why it shut down unexpectedly. After applying the above steps, if the problem persists, do a factory reset on your Samsung Galaxy A34. It will definitely solve your problems. Following the steps will surely fix the sudden shutdown issue on the Samsung Galaxy A34. If you are still facing this problem, go to your phone service center and have it fixed. Samsung Galaxy A34 screen is frozen or stuck. You may encounter this problem while playing games, performing tasks, or making calls. This problem is mainly caused by low RAM on your Android phone. Follow the steps below to fix this problem. Screen frozen issues. How to fix screen frozen or stuck on Samsung Galaxy A34. First, check for Android updates on your smartphone. If an update is available now, update it immediately. 
If there are any apps on your phone that you are not using, uninstall them or force stop them. Restart your Samsung Galaxy A34 in safe mode and wait to see if the problem goes away. If not, restart your phone normally and remove the app that caused the problem. Sometimes you may encounter a frozen screen issue when your phone has low memory or less storage space on your phone. If you are experiencing this issue while using an app, do the following. Go to apps. See all apps. Select the app you are having issues with and clear its cache. The last steps are to factory reset your Samsung Galaxy A34 smartphone. It can solve all your problems. Also, how to install custom ROM on Samsung Galaxy A34. Custom ROM download file may or may not be available depending on development. The main reason for this problem is RAM. I hope after following the instructions above, you will be able to solve this problem. Apps open slowly on Samsung Galaxy A34. You must have often seen that many apps open very slowly. You will face this problem on all phones. If this problem reaches your phone, follow some simple steps. Slow opening of applications. How to fix apps that open slowly on Samsung Galaxy A34. Is Bluetooth disconnected when turning on Bluetooth and connecting to other devices? If yes, then follow the steps given below. Bluetooth connectivity issues. How to fix Bluetooth connection issue on Samsung Galaxy A34. Make sure your device is not running in safe mode. This problem can occur due to OTA updates. So, check if there is any update available. If you made any changes to your Bluetooth settings, be sure to restore the default settings. Check if your device is discoverable by other phones. Turn off your phone's Bluetooth for a few minutes, then turn it back on. Remove all previously paired devices from your Samsung Galaxy A34 and check if the problem is fixed. Cracked display and touch not working on Samsung Galaxy A34. If your Samsung Galaxy A34 screen is broken and you want to access the data, follow the steps below. Cracked display and touch not working. How to access data if touch phone not working on Samsung Galaxy A34. With a USB cable, you can connect your Samsung Galaxy A34 to your computer, laptop. By doing this, you can easily access all your data. If you stored your data on a micro SD card, take it out and insert it again. Check if this fixes the problem. The problem may be a failure of the screen sensor. Check it and take the required action. If you want to use any apps on your phone, you can use an OTG cable. Connect the wireless keyboard and mouse. This way, you can access your phone like a PC. You can try the above steps if your touch functionality is not working. Wi-Fi connection problem or low Wi-Fi range on Samsung Galaxy A34. If you are facing slow internet speed using Wi-Fi, then you can follow the below steps to solve this problem. Wi-Fi connection problem. How to fix Wi-Fi connection issue on Samsung Galaxy A34. Sometimes bad weather conditions may be the reason. You may encounter this problem a lot during rainy or unpleasant weather. Check your modem if there is a problem, or you can reset its settings. You can try to turn on the wireless router and IE.